Hello, my name is Amparo Lopez and I teach at Hydraulic and Environmental Engineering Department in Universitat Politecnica de Valencia. In the learning object of today, we will learn about hydraulic machinery for energy conversion, giving solutions from renewable source from big to small size. When we finish, we will be able to understand the implications of the renewable energy in the total of energy supplied in the different systems and we will be able to know the classification of hydraulic machinery for different energy applications. We will be speaking about the need of energy for transformation and development, the energy conversion as a renewable energy source, the hydraulic energy among other renewable source, what's hydropower, we will be speaking about from big to small and finally we will conclude. In fact, we need energy transformation for development and sustainable development have some implications about the use of renewable energies who are expected to be more widely used and implemented to maintain sustainable objective goals in the future. Energy conversion and ener renewable energy source must count with hydraulic machinery, with hydropower facilities, because we are a potential energy created by different water levels aspects. In general, in a human time scale, we are in a future, in a near future, using renewable energy source. Renewable energy is energy that collected from renewable source naturally definition and replenished on a human time scale in the nature, and we do not have carbon footprint. Hydraulic energy is a very important part of this sort of energy among others like wind, like uh, solar or different. In fact, many countries are implementing them more and more and it must be an alternative to fuels energy with carbon footprint. Hydropower is this energy obtained from the potential energy of water and moving water and we need a shaft or turbine or any machine, any mechanical aspect to converse this energy. In fact, hydropower machinery must be considered in some open channel systems and some pressurized systems. In fact, we have traditional machines, pumps and turbines and adapted machines who can be used instead pump or turbine, both combined in pressure systems. These are very important because we, have, we can get the best efficiency in this sort of machines. In fact, we will consider the flow versus the heat and see how is the flow and heat treat if it is more vertical machine with more head than flow or more horizontal one. In this case, we will have these pertinent turbines in more or less in these parts of the scales. We have the Francis in the middle one, the Rias, Kaplan and other valve cross flow. It depends on the degree of reaction of the machine, the transformation in between velocity and head inside the machine. But all of, all of them, all these turbines can be as big or as small as we want or as we need in order to get energy from different heads and different flows. For example, here we have some Pelton machines, bigger and smaller. Here we have Francis machines, very big and very small uses in scale of lab. Or we can have these Kaplan machines, bigger or smaller in different sizes. And all of them will transform energy of flow and head into mechanical energy of inertia and velocity. In general, we can use also machines in reverse operation, which are pumps as turbines. In this case, we can use them as pump 
giving energy in sort of hydraulic energy or as turbine getting energy from energy in hydraulic manner. These pumps as turbines are transformation of energies and they can give us an idea of about with a lot of a big number of machines because we have a lot of pumps we can have energy in this size given energy from the water hydroelectric energy into mechanical energy using machines that were thought as pumps in this case it can be some sort of reversibility and finally we can choose the machine well as pump well as turbine and these are a solution for a small, small operation levels. As a conclusion, we want to see that renewable energy is a need to achieve sustainability in energy source. Among all renewables, hydraulic energy is a solution that can be used and implemented in a wide range of applications. And hydraulic machinery are the mechanical solution, the technical solution to get this energy coming from different sources and without carbon footprint. Due to a big number of geometries and classification, hydraulic machines are a must when we think about renewable energies in different, different size, from very big to very small. That's all I wanted to tell you in this object. I hope it was of interest on you. Thank you very much indeed.